right guys, welcome to York, Pennsylvania. And uh, we are at uh, Bones and Chill. Now uh, they have a, uh, a prime rib challenge here. It's called the Beast Cut. And you have an hour to do this thing now. This is a hundred dollar cut of beef. Molly Skyler's back there. A hundred dollar cut of beef. Um, prime rib, you have two sides, you have a salad. And then we thought what was originally just gonna be cornbread ended up turning into chocolate pie. Peanut butter pie. Peanut butter pie, which is delicious. Like it just kept getting better, like steak and sides and hey, they get a piece of pie. I'm like, a pie? That's what I'm talking about. So anyways, we're here to try out this uh, challenge. Now this uh, may not really be listed anywhere, so I guess we're quite possibly the first competitive eaters to ever come in here and try this. Most likely. I think most likely. So uh, let's go ahead and check this thing out. Alright guys, so uh, Bones and Shell brought out the uh, beast, the beast cut here. It's massive, um, massive four ounces. You got a slice of pie, I got baked beans, I got a salad, and I got a baked potato over here, and a cornbread muffin. Uh, you got an hour to get this done. It's a hundred bucks if you fail it. You get a hundred dollars if you beat it. So you basically get it for free. Um, Molly Skyler fashion, she got two because she's really hungry today. So we're gonna uh, get into this thing. I like how we go. You took mine up too? Alright, guys. Are we ready? We're gonna do this casual Friday, so I'm not gonna wolf it down. Alright. Right. I have nice clothes on today. Okay, so are we ready? Yeah, we're ready. Go. In three, two, uh, one. Uh, prime rib. We're right, so hot! You get to 146, you get to 246. That's hot! <laughs> Ouch. I think uh, the last time I had prime rib was like uh, 10 years ago, maybe? No, 15 years ago. I love prime rib. Molly's Gar likes prime rib so much, once she ate 22 pounds of it. It was pretty good. When Anderson was still alive, he used to love this pan. I'm not a huge fan of the fat. But I will eat it. See? I got coleslaw on my lap. Fat and steak. Make sure you're up here. It also tastes like fat. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bring your place down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> For you squeamish guys out there, this isn't blood. It's my own My Yes. Not, not, not protein though. Protein's only four grams. Or four calories a gram. Baked taters. Baked taters. Baked taters. Phenomenal. Oh, it's got scream on it. Sour scream. Look at this, Nathan Klein, it's your brother, Tater. 
container plant. Oh, there we go. Here, here. We don't care, we're not shy. And we're gonna have we're gonna have the butter with the potato. This is just oh I like this. Throw the sweet butter I just put on my potato. Crap. Hmm? You want some more sweet butter? No. <laughs> Honey butter potatoes. Ah, oh, whatever. That's fine. I don't need that much butter. I'm just like, ah oh, crap. This is like the size of a yeah, that's huge. Still not the biggest baked potato I've ever seen. Ah. Potato. Nice. Yep. Salt over there. Wow, those beans were like liquid magma. That's the first thing I ate too. Liquid magma. What uh, Liquid hot magma. Should have got a fat-free ranch. Try to keep the calories in. Diet Coke, keep the calories down. Diet Coke, help keep the calories down. Like the spicy It's really hot. <laughs> hot. Hot, liquid hot magma. Supreme. 
I still want to eat like math chunks of fat. That's what I got here.
somewhat civilized today. Hope you all like this. And if I, if I, need, if I at the end, if I need, if I need to swallow big chunks of stuff, <laughs> I, I'll do it. I've done it before. I prefer not to. Yeah. It's like it's just like a big old. And that's the worst thing. It's like if I could save this fat, I would probably make a really good soup out of it. The table next to us is sampling a bunch of different sushi rolls. Sushi roll. It's gross. Yeah, all of it. I use my teeth to cut it. Sushi rolls are huge. <laughs> Oh, it's phenomenal. This is really good. good. Yeah. I don't think I had a steak that good in Texas. I don't think I I'm a Texas resident. I actually am. Not. Never trust a skinny show. So my grandfather said he was 525 pounds and 21 inches. <laughs> <laughs> Four-ounce beast challenge here at uh, you know, it's just delicious from start to finish. Some of the best prime rib I've ever had. The sides phenomenal. And the baked potato, and now the cake. You know that that's what I'm all about because cake is. I think I should have a shirt that says "Cake is life," "Pie is life," something along that lines. But uh, it's just it's just delicious. So if you're ever in this area, you are make sure that. Uh, you stop in here at Bones and Shells and have yourself a steak. Now, I don't recommend trying to eat the beast because it's 100 bucks if you fail it. So don't fail it. But if you come hungry and you can finish it, you get it for free. So uh, tell Don we sent you and uh, they'll treat you like royalty. Hi. Check out Molly Channel. Take it and remember, love is giving away the last piece of cake. No matter how much you want it. No matter how much you want it. Rule number 211. Protect the jeans. Protect the jeans.